following network. Today on the road to GABF, we're at one of my favorite breweries on the planet, Firestone Walker Brewing Company in Paso Robles, California. And I got a lot to learn today about sustainability, about their 25 years in beer. It's their anniversary. I've been around for a good portion of that. So I'm looking forward to go and hear the story of Firestone Walker. Come with me. I'm here with David Walker uh, from Firestone Walker Brewing Company, of course, and um, always a pleasure to see you. I love coming to your brewery. Um, thank you. You know, I was we just having you. Uh, thank you. I, I was just kind of saying to you, I've seen Firestone grow for the last uh, 15 years or so. Actually, I think I've been around your your company. Um, this year is your 25th anniversary, but I'm curious about where you even started because it wasn't in this room I'm sitting in. Yeah, no, it wasn't. <laughs> Uh, you guys had a pretty humble beginning. We, humble in some ways, but also just were blessed. I mean, we're a family business. We were we were born out of the um, the vineyards of the Firestone uh, Vineyard. Okay. Third generation family winery. Adam and I are um, uh, our family. We're related. We're brothers in law. Uh, we we both sort of had a bias for. Um, uh, the concept of taking stuff from grain to glass mm -hmm. um, and uh, you know what I like to say the sort of the Willy Wonka the Wonka factor of creating something sure interesting though interestingly you you guys started with a more traditional beer though I mean Firestone DBA was kind right. of an old world beer too right well, we were traditional I mean we like, like I said we started our brewery on a vineyard I mean we weren't working out of a, an industrial park in Chicago sure you know we sort of worked within traditional structures and by the way, I mean, we're sort of, um, we sort of enjoy that. Um, we, that was, you know, we, we didn't, you know, we wanted to honor some of the great traditions of the great British brewery. So can I ask you this? Um, I've also watched the entire industry evolve and that evolution is rather rapid and, and broad. Well, let me just get to the point. I don't see a seltzer on the shelf yet from Firestone <laughs> Walker. No, and you know, um, you, you you won't. I mean, I say that um, you know over my dead body, but you know you never say never. Right. I mean, let me tell you where our thought is at the moment. I mean, we our brewery was born out of beer culture and a love for um, sort of an artisanal riddle, uh, which we, we we've sort of struggled with. You know, trying to make the perfect beer, and, and Matt's obviously central to that. And I think. Um, for us to make a seltzer, no pun intended, completely dilutes that. You know, we move from beer culture to business culture because that's the only reason we'd make one. So I'm on the road to GABF right now. You know, I've watched the, the amount of awards that you guys have won there. I'm not just patting you on the back here. I just right. remember sitting there thinking, how is that even possible with the amount of beers that were entered into this yeah. competition? I, you know, hey, listen, I'd like to say it was us. Um, but, um, you know, Adam and I brewed for four years before we bumped into Matt. Okay. And we would dream of being able to get a medal at the JDF and we tried. And um, Matt showed up and um, all of a sudden we started winning. I'm standing here with my friend Matt Brittleson, of course the brewmaster here at uh, Firestone Walker Brewery Company. We're in his uh, largest fermentation room, which are like 1,500 barrel fermenters. What do you have, six of them or something? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I actually thought it would be a good backdrop just because of all the technology in here. Um, looks super cool to me. But I wanted to talk about some of the other tech going on here with you. So we've talked beer a, a bunch of times when I've been here and, and I always enjoy doing that. But you guys have some new projects going on that I thought worth covering. Uh, in particular, I saw a massive solar array out there that you guys have been working on for years, I think. Well, I've certainly been thinking about it for years and we finally pulled the trigger. It's nine acres of solar array. Here in Paso Robles, we have you know, abundance of sunny days. So yeah. it makes complete sense. 
Um, and, you know, off peak, it will be at uh, over 100% and at peak, probably something like 50% of our total electrical needs. Which is a ton of electrical. Yeah, so it's, yeah, it's, it's pretty amazing. Um, you know, Adam and David have always been behind it and now is the right time. Yeah, and, and you were telling me that this other part of it, in fact, one of the reasons your brewery is located here is that there are these, there's like this large underground river that flows through here. Yeah. Great for you to brew with. Um, yeah. But there's something that happens to that water as you're using it, as residents use it, it becomes harder and harder, I think you were explaining. Yeah, and we're in a, in a large water basin and as everyone uses it, process softens, whatever they do with the water, the water hardness increases over time. So we're working really hard to, you know, um, you know, reverse that process if anything else. And that's by diversifying our water sources, doing some of our own um, processing of incoming water. I mean, it needs to be sound is the most important part of brewing. So, you know, we, we're very conscious of the water that we bring in, but then we're also trying to discharge water at or better than we've received it. And I think okay. that that completes the circle. Um, yeah. That together with the solar really helps. Um, there's more we can do and we'll continue to progress in that direction as we can. So I'm here now with Adam Firestone um, at uh, Firestone Walker Brewing Company, of course. And uh, well, first I want to say uh, congratulations on uh, 25 years in business. It's been a long road. <laughs> it's a feat. <laughs> Feels a lot longer than 25 years. <laughs> <laughs> so let's talk a little bit about your triumphs. Uh, I am on my way to the Great American Beer Festival producing this, the, the road to GABF. Yep. Uh, your team has had quite a lot of success at the, at the competition sure. uh, in in Denver over the years. Can you talk to me about what that means to you personally and, and to the company? I think um, a brewery wants to be cover all the spaces. You wanna try a little of everything. You wanna be able to play every instrument in the, in the band. But inevitably, there's probably your talents are gonna end up in one area. I'll look to our brewer in, for large measure for the responsibility for this because it's it clearly fell on Matt's strong suit. I always wonder if, you know, if he'd been a, you know, porter or, you know, maybe a stout aficionado and that's where our direction, you know, would have taken us down that path. Maybe, probably. Sure. Um, you know, you you go to you, you go on the field with the players that you have and, and you build your team around the, the stars. And I think we've done that. told both Adam and David, you know, I've been watching you guys grow through my whole career. So for 15 years in this, and I'm amazed every time I come back here, there's a new block. You guys are like Google now. You have a oh, campus. <laughs> I know you hate that. You guys have a campus though. Um, but it's really cool to see. It's fun to watch. Um, and that's your beers doing that. Do you ever, do you ever stop and think about that? That like, you know, my recipes are doing this. <laughs> it's part, it's, it's a massive team effort from of end course. to end. Um, but yeah, it's, it's really rewarding to know that you had some part in yeah. that process and in that growth. Uh, we have an amazing family, and if you ask me what I'm most proud of through all of it, uh, it's, not, it's not a beer, it's, it's not an award, but it's the people that we've attracted and the family that we've managed to maintain here in Pasadena. Sure. So. 